It turns out for all these years I've been living in a lie. I was always under the impression that I had included a pair of scenes in the end of this video, which I made a long time ago about what happens if you refuse to help Ceres and Yalmar with their tasks. So there are two scenes, along with their codex entries, that reveal their fate in this scenario. And sadly, it turns out they both die. Not going to replay the whole sequence here, but the first clue comes right after Svanriga goes berserk on the Nilfgaardians and you successfully defeat them. It's in the conversation with Ermion. What happened to Ceres and Hjalmar? As soon as the Imperial fleet was spotted on the horizon, Hjalmar rallied the longships, set sail to face it. Ceres went with him. Neither has returned. If you remember how the scene ended, Svanriga leading the Jarls into battle, they can actually be found down at the docks, and it is there when you can talk to Krach himself one more time before he dies as well. And there he flat out reveals the truth. Wanted to talk. You'll be hard pressed to defeat the Imperial fleet. We will conquer or perish. Yalmar and Ceres showed us how to die like heroes. Can't say how sorry I am about your loss, Jarl. They died a good death. And finally, although this is available even before you spoke to Krach, you can check their codex entries, which also confirm their deaths. In the case of Yalmar, it ends with his hot temper turned out to be his doom in the end, Young Ankrate died alongside his sister while leading one of the first attacks on the Nilfgaardian fleet. And Ceres' entry ends with, sadly, Krak's daughter died alongside her brother during a failed attack on the Nilfgaardian fleet, the inhabitants of Skellige long mourned the brave Sparrowhawk's premature death. And so that was it. I've rewatched a lot of my videos through the years, um, but it seems I never realized that I had missed this. I hope it was helpful to those of you who may not have been aware of their fate in this scenario, and that was all. Thank you very much for watching, thank you for your support, and until the next video, stay tuned and be good. How are things on Pharaoh? There is always. It's pissing buckets and fucking freezing. See, you're bursting with pride. No use cutting seal shit with honey. Pharaoh is a rock overgrown with pines, but with no need for more. Can't eat pine wood. But use it to build a longship, and you'll eat your fill of what others have grown and bred, after you've taken their wenches and their gold, burned their homes to the ground. That's how Clan Dimon lives. Farewell. <laughs>